Passengers on board a plane that crashed in Bali have described the panic that erupted when they plunged into the water. The pilot has blamed strong winds for the accident, which left dozens of people injured. The 108 passengers and crew on board were given no warning at all. One moment they were preparing for landing, seconds later their plane was down. The fuselage torn in two and water rushing into the cabin. Survivor Andres Presidio said there was no sign that anything was wrong with the plane. He said there was a loud noise and then the plane was down in the water next to the runway. Passengers have told how panic set in as people scrambled to find their life jackets and make it to the exits. City Susilawati was sitting right where the plane cracked open. Her nose was broken on impact and she feared she was going to drown. When the plane crashed, all the luggage dropped down and she doesn't know what hit her on the nose. It just happened very quickly and water came in all around her. The Lion Air Boeing 737 was only a few months old. The pilot has told investigators his plane was hit by wind shear as it approached the runway, downdrafts causing it to drop like a rock straight into the water. From out here on the water, you realise just how lucky those 108 survivors were. Just a few metres more and their plane would have smashed nose first into that runway wall. The results of that could have easily been catastrophic. About 40 people were taken to hospital, most released after being treated for minor cuts and bruises. Four remain in hospital tonight, but none of their injuries are considered life-threatening. In Bali, Grant Taylor, 7 News.